Get over here! I don't know. I don't believe that's how you pronounce it. So it so it pronounced it as crux. I want to find like a Marion Webster um, pronunciation. <laughs> um, what else did I use for that? Um, not quick focus. Uh, okay, uh, context guys. Um, Patty's looking up something that we kind of need to uh, figure out. Cruces. I'm actually gonna well, go with the, the plural shape of moon is cruces. What? The plural is cruces. Cruces. What? That's the plural. But it, no, the the singular is crux. That's weird. But so, but that I guess is English then, because it's or, or it origin. Latin. So we don't know. Um, um, okay. So context. Co context, guys. Um, some of you guys may be familiar with this, but uh, Patty likes to drink uh, this one. Uh, Water. drink called or this it, it's basically it's basically seltzer water for all intents and purposes yeah. um but it's called and like, everyone who who knows what it is already knows what the name is before we've said it it's lacroix yeah right but i i swear it's pronounced lacroix because you know french but i could be wrong i guess because i've heard because i've heard lacroix used as a name because it's like totally like trying to be fancy in french even though it's literally just water right um it has literally two ingredients. Yeah, water and flavor. Huh. It's not fancy. <laughs> I, I know it's not fancy. I just, like, find it weird. I mean, not saying... not. Then again, I'm not necessarily the best person to talk to when it comes to pronouncing stuff. I've been I've mispronounced a lot of things on my channel before. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yes. We all we all know we all know about a certain dragon turtle who, by the way, is all over the internet in a serious. Oh yeah. Role. What what's the rule that turns characters into it's not like, the opposite rule, gender? It's not actually so. It's. Uh, oh I don't know hi. I thought you meant rule 34, but it's, it's not rule 34. But um, it's the it's actually the reason for it is because so it, it, the, the, the 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 crown. Yeah, the crown. So people are like, oh, what? like th there is a crown. I mean, most people, most of you guys probably already know. Um, yeah, but, but we might as well a, address it because it's very prominent right now. There was a crown um, in uh, what was was it? Eight tennis. That, that um, was Mario in? Power Tennis or, or Mario Tennis Aces. Yeah. Um, so it was in Mario Tennis, and it's like this item, and it turns a Toadette into Peach. So people are like, hmm, what happens when you put that crown on other things? And yeah. someone made like a webcomic of Mario getting rejected. Mario and Bowser getting rejected by Peach, and then Browser just pulling out the crown and turning into like a Bowser Peach. Yeah, and, th and that just like exploded. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine with it. I, th I think it's kind of funny. Okay, so um, context to also what's going on here. Um, I am using a spellcaster's build. Um, I'm using uh, the shaman stone and the spell twister. Um, but I'm also including the shape of Oon, but that's specifically for what what's coming up soon. Um, so how's it going, everybody? Welcome to episode 39 of Let's Play Hollow Knight. I am the Green 39. Scorpion. I'm Pad. Yeah, and we're talking about uh, we're talking about fancy French uh, fizzy drinks <laughs> and. Uh, Lady Bowser. Yeah. What do you think of that whole thing, by the way? Peach would probably drink LaCroix. She probably would. But, uh... She would drink the Pomplemousse oh my God. flavor, which is the best flavor. That is seriously sick, that ability. Yeah. Alright. Definitely, definitely a lot more useful than it was before we got the, up, uh, before we got the upgrade. Absolutely. Oh, wait. That was weird. It almost looked like it tracked up for a second and, like, yeah, see how that had the black Yeah, it's, it, that, it's because it's a descending dark. That, those, those, that, like, black trail doesn't do damage coming down. It does. Those, oh, really? Yes, it does. It's the descending dark upgrade that I got, uh, from, uh, uh, re remember when that really, really annoying area in the Crystal yeah, Peak? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, yeah, no, that's no, where no, we got the descending it. dark. And, uh, that's what's causing that, uh, little updraft of power. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, we've already oh, yeah, been we, here. Oh, yeah, we've been here, but we can't get in there because... It's just Something's wall. blocking off. Okay, I'm pretty sure. Do you see that path? No, I think we've already you, been. You see over that path to the north? Yeah. That has to lead in there. Oh, we've yeah. We've never right. been in that yeah, area. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Oop, wrong. Okay, here we go. Rip. Oh, son of a. Rest in pepperoni. <sighs> you said that before. I say that relatively often. Not you, as much. You, I used to say it a lot, and I don't say it as much anymore. You don't say it as often anymore, but you've said that before on this on this playthrough. Ah. There we go. 
All right, so now that we took care of him, that makes this guy so much easier. Get wrecked, son. That is a really, really sick ability. And yeah, the spell, I can definitely see the difference with the spell twister. It is mm -hmm. seriously mitigating the uh, cost of those, uh, Ooh, of those spells. Oh. oh, you got so close to getting snapped. I'm okay with that. <laughs> that was so close. It like probably like whiffed a little the hairs. I think I'm pretty head. sure it whiffed only because I was ducking to grab the item. Probably. That's funny. I almost I almost uh I almost hope they did that on purpose. Ooh. There we go. Get him, son. Ooh. All right, but yeah, I'm also going with the shape of Un because of the, uh, we're, we're going to try again now against that dream boss, mm. or the dream warrior, and I believe the shape of Un is going to come in handy with that. Oh, bouncy boy? Uh, yeah, bouncy boy. Okay, we got that. Now we got to take care of you so I can get some much needed soul. There we go. Get him. There we go. Get him. All right. All right. So well, now we're out of soul, but whatever. we're out of soul now. But uh, we're gonna. Oh, there we go. Convenient. Might as well get some from this guy too. Mm -hmm. All right. Here we go. We're gonna try this again. Hello, sir. Marmu, right? Yep. Let's go. Uh, shall we wait? Yep. Let's play. Oh, jeez. Yeah, this guy's really annoying. Kind of reminds me of Yoshi a little bit. A little bit. Oof. Yeah, he totally reminds me of Yoshi. Oh my gosh. No, he he tracks real hard. You don't really get much time to. Oh yeah, that helps. That is yep. like way helpful. Oh man. Ooh. Oh, oh I see. Oh, I wish I knew that. Hmm. That kind of trivializes this fight now. Now that I know how to do that. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Admittedly, you did not know that, so I don't blame you for not knowing. That was tough. Like, it, like if you couldn't do that, I feel like this guy would be real crazy hard. Ah! I mean, you still died. I that. still died. Um, <laughs> I don't think the shape of Un is working here. Okay, now that I know that, um, I'm going to go ahead and change Get the... a long nail. Yeah. No, I'm going to get the Mark of Pride, man. Yeah, that's what I meant. The Mark but... of Pride... Quick foc not not glowing one. Quick focus, and I'm gonna go with the thorns of agony on this one. All right, we'll be right back, guys. Wait, where's my shadow? Right there. Oh, there it is. How did it end up on the other side? It was on the. It was where we. I don't know. Um, actually, okay. Before we uh, before we move on, I want to do this. Over. Oh. Oh, is this a station? Cool. Um, yeah, it is, and we oh, can. Oh, that's a much better bench. Yep. So we can rest here. I noticed that there was this like glass thing here when we were when we were coming back. So I was like, there must be something there that we can like instigate a shortcut. But hey, turns out we can actually uh, unlock another stag station. Nice. Cool. I'm actually gonna talk to this guy because if I if my prediction is correct. I found it. Yes, the stag nest where oh. I was born and raised. If you unlock all of the stag stations, you will unlock the stag nest. We need this for 100%. Oh, okay. I've yet to go there again. My duty binds me to travel only where I am called, but if you wish to see it yourself, I could take you there. None may remain to welcome us, but the nest is still a sight to behold. Give me the word and I will go there at once. <gasps> so, that's something we definitely want to do after this. Um, I want to explore the all uh, uh, the rest of this place as well and defeat this guy before we do that. All right. Defeat Yoshi. Yep. Let's try this again, Marmu. I'm ready for you this time. Ugh. I still gotta time it right. Yeah, you do. But I mean, like, it's definitely better than trying to dodge. If I can go right under him uh, before he... Uh... Oh, that's gonna be tough. I mean, you still have, like, it's... You can still 
Like one, one, one hits not. You can dash through it when he does that. Like when he, when yeah, he's you're not right. in ideal you, you, position. You are right. You are right. You can dash through him when it's not ideal positioning. Like right there. Ooh. Mm, mistimed it. Yeah. Got him. Yeah, that. That's All not right. that bad when you. Yeah, use once that. I learned the pattern, I was able to get it. Yeah. I didn't even need the quick juggling, focus. Juggling, juggling. All right. Uh. Oh, wait. Yeah, you did. Oh, the voice. stranger, you're. I don't remember what the voice I did before. Yeah, just up. go with it. Oh, stranger, you're strong. Much stronger than me. I've been waiting a long time, stranger. I've been fighting a long time, stranger. I'm very, very tired. The queen will be here soon, and I just need to sleep a little. Wake me when the queen arrives, stranger. Perhaps the queen will teach us both to fly, stranger. Perhaps the queen will teach us both to fly, stranger. Fly, you fools! <laughs> that would be fun, wouldn't it? All right, another dream warrior down. I'm sorry, he said stranger so many times. I was like, I had, I had to reference Resident Evil Four. Danger. Um, we never expected this. Protector of root and leaf, we honor you. Hmm. Well, there you go. All right, so what else do we have here? I want to explore the rest of the Queen's Gardens first before okay. we hit the stag station, uh, or the stag nest. Maybe we'll actually hit the stag nest before we, uh, uh, before we decide to, uh, or rather the stag nest, uh, after, like, maybe we explore this area. Depending on how long it takes, we might save it for the next episode. Mm -hmm. All right, so there we go. Another yeah. dream warrior down. Alrighty. So, how have you been? Playing any uh, uh, playing any new games recently? Uh, you're, that was a loaded question, wasn't it? It was a loaded question, Because you yes. know what I've been playing. Yeah, uh, you've been playing Octopath Traveler. I've been playing Game with a Really Bad Name. Um, which rhymed, actually. Uh, you don't like- you don't like Octopath Traveler as a name? Uh, I think the name is really bad. Um, that- which, honestly, that's like a stupid- like, that's not really a criticism of the game, because, like, it doesn't affect the actual game itself at all. But yeah, it definitely, it definitely is the name of a JRPG. You can definitely tell it's a JRPG by that name. Um, even more so because uh, the first letters of each character's name spells Octopath. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> I um, feel like... Ulbrich, Cyrus, Tressa, Ophelia, uh, Primrose. Oh, yeah, yeah, I gotcha. Uh, you know, you know, the, you know yeah, the drill. Yeah. You know the drill. The thing, it sounds, so Octopath sounds like a name that if you don't speak English and speak Japanese but think English is cool then it sounds like a good name and that's why it because like Japan does that all the time they'll take a word and like turn it into and like like twist it and turn it into a new word and it's like what this is weird that's not what that word means you know what you're not wrong there is a there is literally a term called wase ego which means j English that is invent like english that is created in japan really yes and you and it's very interesting you get some weird stuff i wouldn't have guessed that yeah um but it, that is a thing that happens but um other than that it, it's decent um there are a few great there are a few gripes i have about the battle system um i mean the one is sort of one of, it's not it's an issue that's not really exclusive to that game it's just something I'm really not a huge fan of, um, which is like the semi-randomness of turn order. Um, I mean, I've, it's determined by speed, and you can control it somewhat it, with it, certain abilities. Yes, but it's still semi-randomized. Um, oh, what the? Uh, oh, Mantis! Oh, cool. Get him. Oh, oh this is probably a rush, a boss rush. It is. Or a monster it has rush. to be. Um, but I've already actually had a situation where I I more or less got screwed. As in, like, there was literally nothing I could have done to survive the situation. Oh, what? Oh. The Traitor Lord! Oh, dang it. Wasn't expecting this here. I wasn't expecting Ooh, this either. shot two out. He's kind of slow, though. He is. I gotta use... I just gotta use the, uh, the, uh, the Shade Cloak to uh, trivialize his attacks somewhat, but again, it's it's the timing is a little is a little strict. Yeah, a little bit. Oh, I have an idea. Oh, what the? Huh. That's a, that did a decent amount of damage. He has a lot of health. Ooh, yeah, that was a that was an impossible. 
Oh, wow. Okay, he does two pips of damage yeah, with that. Hurts. Okay, I did not realize. Glad I found this stag station before anything else. Yeah. All right, so we'll be back again. I'm getting killed a lot today. Yeah. There we go. Beat him. Yep. All right. I gotta defeat these uh, mantis. Uh, the mantis first. But as I was saying, with like the semi-randomized turn order, is there still like an element of randomization to it? Um, and what was it? I, I was think it's on... determined by like speed. But it is again. partially, but not completely. Otherwise, if it was determined by speed entirely, uh, the turn order would more or less be the same every turn, and it's not. It, it fluctuates quite quite a bit. Um, but I was fighting this boss, um, it's not really spoilers, um, because you kind of like know right off the bat when you know what this character is that you're gonna fight it eventually. But, right. Um, there's like a character as a tattoo on his left hand. Oh, and you yeah, know I know about. who you're talking and about. And that's not really a spoiler. It's not, it's um, not. Um, and he has this move that, it's an AoE, it's one of those charge moves, so like the idea is you get, he, he, he uh, telegraphs it a turn before he does it. So you have time to react to it, um, which is cool. That's fine. Um, and what this attack does is it's an AOE that has a chance to inflict unconscious. So unconscious basically means you can't move or act. That's fine. The the problem with it... Ooh, that was a, that was a rough hit. The problem with it is um, when you add the semi-randomized turn order into it, you can get some bullshit happening. Ugh. I see what you're talking about. <laughs> so I will tell you, ex so this literally happened to me and I got really upset. Hold that thought. <laughs> but as I was saying- Yeah, go ahead. I got the sharp shadow equipped now, so I should be have an easier time, but go ahead. So what's bullshit is this guy has the charge attack and all that's cool and dandy and the unconscious is a fine, is an all right mechanic it's dealable with. So I'm playing, I spend about 15 minutes, I'm like pretty much destroying this guy. It's just literally the fact that he, it, basically it's an HP sponge at this point. I'm not having any trouble. I'm not really ever coming close to dying. I, I, I'm dealing with all of his moves for the most part. Um, so turn comes around about 15 minutes in. Maybe right. Less, I don't know. But he acts last that turn. Uh-huh. It does his attack, then does his charge. The next turn, he immediately acts first. Oh. And then after that, he AoEs my whole team and then inflicts unconscious for four turns on every single party member. Oh. I can't dispel it. It's imp I can't use items. I can't do anything. I literally have four turns of I can't take an action. So naturally, I die because I went from full health to having no health because he still had the... Because, like, he also still had the minions because I realized that basically pointless to kill the minions because they'll respawn anyway. Um, but, like, the fact, that would be, like, completely avoided if there wasn't this randomized sort of turn counter thing going on. Because, like, I couldn't, like, yeah, you can predict it. I do like how you can sort of see ahead. You can usually see a turn ahead. Um, and, like, you know, you can, act, like, if someone does it and, like, they're, they're, they're slated to move later in the turn, um, you can be like, okay, well, how many hits can I get in to, um, how many hits can I get in to stagger them before they do this attack? But like, he literally charged up and then immediately did it. And I, and of course, like, I-, I ah! the... <laughs> This guy's tough! Yeah, he is, does a lot of damage. That's his big issue. All right. I think I got a good thing going with it, so I'm gonna try again. I think it's kind of dumb that you basically are forced to waste all your, all your, whatever the boost points, whatever they're called. On, uh, yeah, uh, it's BP. Boost yeah, it's points, BP. I guess. It's boost points. Um, it's boost points. Yeah. Wasting that on Dang one it. just to deal with one mechanic. That's not. That's not cool. That's like stupid. That's I don't agree with that. I mean, I I honestly don't know what to tell you because I never had that issue. Yeah, but like, you see where I'm coming from. I, I do get what you're getting at. Yeah. Uh, other than that, I gotta remember I have these. It's been it's been pretty decent. Um, there's characters I like. There's characters I don't like. Um, they're all, I mean, it's the beginning, but they all seem kind of bland. And I think that's just, I think that's because it's the beginning. Um, but they're, for the most part, they're all, like, kind of, like, they don't have flaws yet, I guess. Or we haven't seen their flaws yet that much. Yeah. Even, like, the thief is like, oh, I'm a thief who's really good and blah, blah, blah. Um, but I'm, I'm sure that will develop. Um, I've done the first, 
the first part of Tressa, Cyrus, and Primrose. I've cleared the first. Gotcha. Um, of each of those. And I really like Tressa a lot, actually, after her first part. Oh, I love Tressa. Yeah, it, it's she's funny. one of my. She's definitely one of my favorites. I do like her a lot, and I've been using her. I started using her more now, and she's uh, she's pretty good. I have her. Um, I have her as a uh, merchant combo with Dancer. Ah. So she's kind of like a. She's like a DPS buff hybrid. It's like she has access to all these buffs that she can use, but she also can dish out a decent amount of uh, wind or dark damage. Oh, wait till you get her her uh, ultimate ability. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see what it is. Um, and then one of oh, my wrong thing. My uh, my other favorite combination is um, okay. Thief tank. I really like thief tank because you have the added evasion to like boost your bulkiness. And then you also have the ability to restore your own SP or your own health in, if you like absolutely need be. Um, so that's like one of my favorites. Um, and then I also really like um, Scholar uh, Scholar Priest Hybrid. Ah, okay. So you've been using Ophelia for that one. Yeah, because um, I don't know. I feel like I don't know. I just I've been using actually Cyrus recently because I've been doing his story and I swapped the two out and just switched the roles. But like uh -huh. Ophelia was doing like I felt like Ophelia was a lot. Got more... him. Nice job. Oh boy, that was tough. I feel like Ophelia was a lot more. Um, I don't know if she was more potent. Like she just maybe it's just what I had equipped and like what I had the loadout, but she was doing a good job. And combo that with the dancer skill that allows you to regenerate SP every turn is like Yeah, I never run out of SP and could just spam really powerful attacks. Cool. I was curious. Anyway, okay, so let me see what's over here, if anything. Doesn't look like it. Um, the only character I don't really like, and I've talked to you about this. Yes. Um, is I don't really like Manit Manat Hani. Ah, uh, Hani, yeah. I don't like her, her accent, her, her, the way she speaks drives me insane. Which is too bad because like, she's actually one of my favorite characters. She's I, my favorite, she's my favorite female of the roster. Mm -hmm. And I honestly find that, oh, wow. Mm -hmm. I honestly find uh, her uh, speech pattern endearing, but that's just me. I, I just, it, it just drives me crazy. Letting us begin in, just, ah, uh, <laughs> ah, uh, it hurts. Uh, okay, but other so. Than that, she's cool. It's just unfortunate that is very. Um, She's got a snow panther, snow leopard, and that's awesome. Yeah, and I so I don't actually like the hunter class much, but I do like her special ability where she can tame beasts. That's really cool. Mm -hmm. It that's makes like, her very versatile. Really cool. It's just like, for me, like her speech pattern is so abrasive that I just like I. It's really hard for me to get into like liking using her. It's just really hard. Oh, what is this? Oh my god! We were talking about Octopath Traveler, and then all of a sudden, this what gets introduced to this. This to thing. What is this? That's Let's so see. serene. Who is getting It's a lot. Eyes. The White Lady. Oh. One arrives. Far it walks to find me. Did it seek my aid? Or did the path carry it by chance to so pertinent a place? It is true. True that you were awaited. No. Perhaps that is inaccurate. True one like you was awaited. I have a gift. How long for one of your kind, half of a whole, when united, great power is granted, and on the path ahead, great power it will need. Ooh, what we get, what we get, what we get. Why do I have a feeling I know what this is? What we get. Do, 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 do. The white fragment. Huh, I guess there's a black fragment. It faced the gendered child. She is a fierce foe. Is that Hornet? Mm -hmm. uh, strong in mind and body, striking reflection of her mother, though the two were permitted little time together. It, I never begrudge the worm's dalliance as I bargain, as bargain. In fact, I feel some affection for the creature birthed. If your paths were to align, I imagine you might gain yourself a powerful ally. Dream Nailer. I, I am going to. So it can access a mind. Oh, that's weird. Then the seals shall break before its blade. Hmm. Okay, no lie, this is cool. So we got a white fragment. Um, Let me see if I can- Wait, that's in your masks. 
It's in your mat. It's it's uh charms. Oh, it's a charm? It's half of a charm. Whoa! Cost five, it cannot be equipped. It's half of a charm. Yeah, it's half of a charm. We need to find the other half. Do you have anything else to say? Within my roots, the weakening of the vessel, I plainly feel. Only two obvious outcomes there are from such a thing. The first is inevitable on current course. Regression. All minds relinquished that pernicu- Wow. Pernicuous. Pernicuous plague. The second I find preferable and would seek your aid in its occurrence. Replacement. Replacement. I implore the first you to usurp the vessel. Its supposed strength was ill-judged. It was tarnished by ideal idea instilled. But you, you are free of such blemishes. You could contain that thing inside. Well, so look, she's tied up. Yes. I think she might have... So the Hollow Knight was chained. She is chained. Mm -hmm. She mentioned the vessel, and she mentioned, like, being related to it. So she might have been... She might have been like a past, a past vessel in that sense, like taking, taking. Oh, that's my phone going off. Oh, about this. okay. <laughs> um, <laughs> anyway, you were saying she might be like a, um, like she might have tried to do the same thing you did, and like not necessarily had the same outcome and been corrupted of Hall Knight, but like it could have been for something else, or it could have like I don't know. I'm just spitballing here. Okay, there is not. There is actually nothing there. Nope. But yeah, no, you are you are correct. Like, sh the white lady clearly knows something of what's going on in, uh, uh, with the Hollow Knight and Hollow Nest in general. Mm -hmm. But, uh, unfortunately, that's all the time we have today. So, oh, no. Eh, no, that's fine. Um, thank you guys for joining us for, uh, episode 39 of Let's Play Hollow Knight. Woo. I'm the Green Scorpion. I'm Pat. And in the next episode, I believe you have a date with the stag. Oh. Ew. If you, if you would like. I mean, there are other things you could do, but... Is the stag pretty? Um, we've met him. Ah! He, oh, no! He's an old dude. But, uh, yes. Um, we're gonna go ahead and, uh, see... Oh, goodness gracious. Um, we're gonna go ahead and see what the, uh, stag nest is all about. Uh, so, until then, see you guys then. You wanna or see you guys next time. You wanna know fun fact, Oscar? This is unrelated to, like, anything we've been doing at all. What? But it what made me think fact? about... So, I was, I was watching something today, and I found out that... The, pretty much the whole reason why Murray from Sly Cooper, his voice is the way it is, is because the, the voice actor was reading like through like a character chart and like his information and saw that his sexual orientation was experimenting. So he tried to be a big gay hippo and that's what stuck. Why am I not surprised by that? I'm just like that's int that's that's cool. That's actually not but, gonna lie. That is actually kind of cool. And now now I can totally see it in his voice. It's just like he has that high pitched like kind of at least in the first game. This also might explain why he's so into disguising as a woman. He really wanted to try out that one outfit uh, that Carmelita used. Oh, that's so true. He's always the woman in all the costumes too, and like he all is. the. the that's, oh my god, this explains everything! <laughs> but like, see, that's good character design. You that know, is. You have, you have like little, little details in your character that, you know, like, are, normally might not come to light, but you know, you can make little tiny nuances and really... Hey, quite frankly... What's character? Quite frankly, mm. I feel them. Mm.